Hello, Center High School. I'm Thomas Rayford. Here are the announcements for Friday, February 15th, 2019. You Can't Take It With You will be performed at CHS on March 7th, 8th, and 9th. The Best Buddies Hidden Rock Challenge is still going on. There are 25 rocks hidden on campus. The red X's represent the rocks that have been found. If you find one of the painted rocks on campus, take a picture and tag at CHS Cougars and at Best Buddies underscore CHS, then take it to room 209 to receive a free snack from the Snack Shack. The boys basketball team will travel to Stockton today to play the number one seed Weston Ranch High School at 7 p.m. in the second round of the playoffs. Please wish the players luck if you see them. Seniors who have taken and passed a total of four AP classes your junior and senior years qualify for an AP court. The cost is $7 to be paid at the ASB window. You must sign up by, with Ms. Winborn by March 1st. Seniors in search of community service opportunities in the Antelope area, check out Mr. Hunter's website, www.mrhuntersclassroom.com. Here's another Black History quote of the day. One of the hardest things in life is having words in your heart that you can't utter. James Earl Jones, James Earl Jones said this, who was an award-winning actor who stuttered as a child and later became well-known for his resonant voice. Email your favorite photos of school events and activities for the Moving Up Rally to chsmovinguprally2019 at gmail.com. Now it's time for our features. Here's the first episode in a new series created by Jaden, Dylan, Dyson, Emmy, and myself called Science Squad. Let's watch. For many years, there's been a great debate dividing this once proud nation. And that is watermelon versus cinder block. Today on Science Squad, we're going to put this debate to rest. Yeah. For our first test, we have the taste test. I'm gonna give that two sciences out of a squad. And now, it's time for the cinder block. I'm gonna give that two sciences out of a squad. Wait. Remember boys and girls, here on Science Squad, we're professionals. Do not, I repeat, do not bite into cinder blocks without parental supervision. Thank you. Two and a half. Now it's time to find out the shoe size. I don't think that fits. I think it fits pretty well. Opinion, opinion test. test! Now it's time for the opinion test. Oh, look. Let's go, 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 go. Right which one do you like more? Uh, I like the watermelon. Yeah! Water, water resistance. resistance. What? All right, homeboys. Now it's time for the water resistance. That's pretty resistant. Now it's time for the cinder block. Real moist in there. Well, uh, our results have been inconclusive so far, so we're gonna give it the good old SPLAT test. SPLAT. It stands for Scientific Plummeting Landing Acceleration Test. Let's go! So, first up, we have our good old cinder block. I'm gonna miss you, bud. All right, fire in the hole. Three, two, one. Yeah! Woo! Next, we got Henrietta the watermelon. All right. Fire in the hole. Three, two, one. Oh. <laughs> it's all the way over there. <laughs> oh my. Dude. So we've decided upon further inspection that the watermelon actually won. We decided that the watermelon won only because it hit the camera. Oh. 
and that's pretty freaking cool. Though, so tune in next time for uh, our next adventure of Coke versus Pepsi. That's it for the news you can use. Thanks for watching CTV.